the good idea is that you're also going to have the possibility to select the enemy that you want to kill but also you're going to have the auto mode on okay which is really really important power stones now in order for you to get those you're going to be able to get those by the shop okay so if you're going to click on them you're going to notice that you can go over here and buy them with gold coins but also with gemstones every time you're going to have enough gemstones come over here and buy this thing okay Welcome to Adelines TV and we're going to check out Puzzle Breakers. Now this is not going to be an idle game, but for sure you can give it a try. A lot a lot of offers when you're going to start the game, but you're going to get meat, you're going to get gems and you're going to get gold coins if you're going to build sufficient things in order for you to collect them. If you're going to collect them, you're going to need to use them in order for you to do what? To upgrade your heroes, okay? So, you're going to have different kind of rarities, you're going to be able to level them up, eventually you're going to be able to fuse them, you're going to be able to make them more stronger, you're able to equip them, unequip them every once in a while in order for you to place better and better items on them, and then go and have some raids, basically the raids are going to be some PvP fights, and also try to fight in the campaign. Now, kind of the same idea in different kind of other game modes as well, you're going to have your 5 heroes on the bottom of the screen, and you're going to need to merge the colors in order for you to cast specific skills depending on the hero eventually in this game now over here this is the campaign mode i need to pass this level in order for me to be able to unlock new and new things most likely in this game and in order for me to do that i need to pass three waves okay now in order for me to pass those three waves i need to kill every enemy that i have in each specific wave and you're going to need to merge these things quite quite a lot now the good idea is that you're also going to have the possibility to select the enemy that you want to kill but also you're going to have the auto mode on okay which is really really important now i do like this feature whenever i'm playing a puzzle game so it it if it has my bad if it has this automate option is really really important because you can play this game also as an idle game in a way so whenever you do not have time but you're strong enough you're just going to need to cast that uh, auto mode on to put it on sorry not cast it and the game will do its trick obviously it will not merge the best things so you need to take a closer look every once in a while when you're going to get stuck in a specific wave what you're going to need to do you're going to need to go back in that wave and try to do your best now remember the automatic mode will not necessarily pass every level every once in a while you're going to encounter a hard boss it's going to be harder for you to pass and you're going to need to play it with your own hand unfortunately but at least it has this feature which is quite quite nice now besides the campaign mode besides the big big bosses that you're going to find over here in the campaign mode i'm going to retreat over here and flee you're going to have other game modes as well besides the campaign as i barely mentioned and you're going to have a big big boss a giant over here that you can fight you're going to have the possibility uh, to recharge these trials you have three trials daily at least at least three uh, try to do as much damage as you can in order for you to qualify for better and better rewards after that as i mentioned you're going to have adventures depending on the day that you're going to log in you're going to have different kind of adventures unlocked and over here in the adventures is really really easy for you to put the auto mode on this is how the game will go so at least in this game you're going to need to merge three similar colors if you're going to merge four you're going to get a skill if you're going to merge five you're going to get a better skill and so on probably have played similar puzzle games i'm not going to mention those type of skills but also as i mentioned you're going to have five different heroes now different meaning that you can choose different kind of heroes for different kind of colors you can have similar heroes in the teams like for example all of them should be for fire for example or all of them should be for poison or whatsoever for dark whatever you want but at least you can put five in your team and if you're going to place five in your team you're going to be able to do different kind of damages depending on the color that you're going to merge so please watch out for that also depends on your strategy and so on now if you have played this one i went further drop a comment let me know keep in mind in order for you to upgrade now everything in your uh, camp let's say you're going to need to pass specific stages in the campaign mode that's how you're going to be able to unlock every feature meaning that you, that's how you're going to be able to upgrade your castle if you're going to have your castle at level 5 you cannot upgrade anything above level 5 okay so keep that in mind 
Now besides that eventually you're going to unlock other features as well, didn't play this game that much but interesting let's say, you're going to get also resources from the castle so please enter over here as well okay. It's not that hard of a game for sure you have played similar games, different kind of resources that you're going to get in order for you to do different kind of summons, a lot a lot of resources by playing daily and you're going to be able to do different kind of summons as I just mentioned, uh, you're going to have even some uh, forge options let's say, and in the forge option you're going to be able to craft new and new items, get new and new items, uh, depending on how much uh, did you play you're going to unlock even this war academy where you're going to be able to build more and more things, upgrade different kind of things, and in the gate mode over here, this is where you're going to do the summons. Now. Some of the heroes will be really weak, so you're going to need to destroy them, obviously. You're going to need to buy hero slots. Unfortunately, you're not going to be able to, uh, let's say, store up those heroes quite, quite easy. So you're going to need to have them at a specific level in order for you to store them up, which is quite, quite hard, believe me. It's going to take a while until you're going to figure out who do you need to level up, or for example, her over here. If I'm going to level her up, eventually I'm going to be able to fuse her and I need specific cards, like for example the same cards, basically the same hero in order for me to be able to fuse her, in order for me to be able to start, him up at, start her up sorry, at, uh, uh, with 4 stars and then most likely I will use her for food. So this game definitely need to play it quite quite a lot. Now every once in a while you're going to notice that you're going to run up out of a specific thing and that means that you're going to run up out of those blue, uh, purple uh, gemstones that you get from here, okay? These power stones. Now in order for you to get those, you're going to be able to get those by the shop, okay? So if you're going to click on them, you're going to notice that you can go over here and buy them with gold coins but also with gemstones. Every time you're going to have enough gemstones, come over here and buy this thing, okay? This is the best way to spend your green things, okay? Spend them in order for you to buy these power stones. You're going to need those quite, quite a lot. Until next time, don't forget to subscribe. Also, a lot, a lot of gemstones, a lot, a lot of mini gameplays, let's say. Even you can spin the wheel over here in order for you to get more and more resources. Definitely do it because if you're lucky enough, you're going to get the best heroes, but most likely will not happen. Guys, until next time, take care, be safe, don't forget to subscribe, smash that like button and please be safe out there. Bye.